What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Platinum Walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we succeeded in uh, migrating some Pokemon straight to Pokemon Platinum, and I've been having kind of like a... Well, I've been put in a crossroads of, like, what Pokemon to use and everything. And I decided, you know what, F it. I'm going to go right here. I'm going to switch the day. We are on Friday, okay? It is Friday into this world of Pokemon. And, well, there is a specific Pokemon that we need to capture, or we have to capture, or... We don't really have to capture, but, you know, it comes out only on Fridays. So I might as well just show you guys where it is. So, if you guys go to Route 205, going into the Valley Windworks, you're going to see yourself a good old Drifloom, I believe. Now, we are completely, completely overpowering this Pokemon. So, we're going to go with some Pokemon that we caught along the way and see what this Pokemon is all about. As you guys can see, it does come out on Fridays and, uh, well, it is at level 15. So we do have to be careful with what happens. So next thing we need to do, Thunder Wave this Pokemon. Remember, this Pokemon is a ghost type Pokemon. So... We can't hit it with physical moves or anything. I am probably going to be going with this. Let's see. Um, do I have what I need? Yes, I do have a Dust Ball. It is nighttime, so it should be easier to capture right here. So Drifloon, you will be mine. Two three there you go okay so there it is guys we got ourselves a Drifloon that quickly yeah holy buckets okay so here it is Drifloon the balloon Pokemon because of the way it floats aimlessly an old folktale tell calls it a signpost for wandering spirits hmm it's pretty cool and I believe I did give it a, uh, a a name, so let's go right ahead and give it. Uh, well, I guess give give it, give it its name. So if you guys remember when I was playing Pokemon Brilliant Diamond, I think I named this Pokemon Pennywise because of you know it being a balloon and you know the movie it was out around that time. I think I don't know. So here we go, Pennywise. How's it going? It's been a while. And well, let's go right ahead and take a look at the the new Pokemon we just caught. Look at this. Drifloon, ghost and flying type Pokemon, the first of its kind. And it does have the ability Unburden, which raises its speed if held item is used. And, uh, well, it does have some pretty good moves like minimum, Minimize, Astonish, Gust, and Focus Energy. Now, in this episode, I'm going to be doing quite a few things. I think that there is something that uh, you can do now that... Now that you are, like, you know, the Pokemon League champion and all that stuff. So we're going to go to Eterna City. And uh, there is a little something-something that's been going on right here. Professor Oak. So if you go here, Professor Oak is uh, sitting right here waiting for you. If you talk to him, he's like, ah, it's you. Good to see you. How is your Pokedex coming along? Capturing every kind of Pokemon is no easy feat. I'll grant you that. But I sure you could accomplish it. And here we have a exclamation point. He's gonna be like, ah, yes! An acquaintance from Kanto has sent me something quite interesting. I think you'd make a be better use of it than I could, I could ever could. And here we get ourselves another upgrade, which can be used to evolve a Porygon. I understand that there is a Pokemon that evolves when it is traded while holding that upgrade. Incidentally, and this is an entirely different topic. I've heard that there have been sightings of very rare Pokemon, the legendary bird Pokemon. Articuno, Zapdos, Moltres. They've been spotted at various locations here in Sinnoh, no less. Why, you may be lucky enough to see them for yourself in your journeys. Which is true, because, well, once you step outside and you look at the map right here, they now appear. So, right there, we have just accomplished something else, which uh, we will be getting to later on in our, in our walkthrough. Now, let's see. Is there anything else that I need to do? Oh, you know what? While we're at it, while we're at it, let's go right ahead and go back to Jubilife City, okay? Because we've won the majority of our badges. I think we can be... I think we, we are able to do this. So we're going to be speeding it up just a tad bit. Yes, I know. It's a bit of a filler episode, guys. My bad. And if you talk to this guy, I think he's like, Hi, hi, president of Pokétech Company. And yes, we get ourselves another Pokétech, and that is the Move Tester. And the Move Tester is used to check on how moves match up. 
type matchups uh, so you can make it all your effect your your attack super effective you'll become stronger than ever and well here we have okay so I think that's pretty much it with the the Pokétech uh, apps and well let's see is there anything else that we need to do because there is a legendary Pokemon right like real close to us um let's see what if we go down here again I'm trying to force the subject <laughs> and it looks like that the legendary Pokemon is right here let's see there it is <laughs> Okay, so here we have Zapdos waiting for us. And I'm gonna be I'm gonna be an idiot, okay? I'm gonna throw a quick ball. Hopefully I am lucky again. But yes, these legendary Pokemon, they do leave as soon as you try and battle them, so the best way to go about this is just to, you know. It's just to damage them, use, uh, what was it called, uh, what's that move called, uh, no escape or something, mean look, and then from there you'll be able to catch with these guys. So, as you guys can see, Zapdos has fled. These Pokemon are for real. Okay. So, that is that. I'm not gonna capture the legendary Pokemon yet, because that's for another episode right there. Let's see. If I'm mistaken, there might be one last thing that we can do before we even move on into the next uh, episode, and that is... Do, 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 do. Let's see, we did that, we did that. Hmm, I think we did everything. Okay, so... Yeah, in the next episode, we're going to be going straight to Snowpoint City. I, I get it, guys. I... I made this episode just because, well, we needed an extra episode. It was what it, it was, what it was, guys. So, in the next episode, we're going to be going up to the battle f location or whatever. And, uh, yeah, we're going to be using a nice array of Pokemon that we got in the... That we got in our, in our you know, in our Poke, uh, Pal Park area and stuff. And, yeah, we're going to have a lot of fun. So, thank you guys again for watching. I'll see you guys next time.